Hello, this is Dale Mercer, and I want to show you how easy it is to use iSystemize Desktop. This is the ultimate tool for organizing and systemizing your business. So let me show you how it works. From left to right, we have department, roles, and processes. Now, department is the area of your business, such as your operations or your sales, your administration, your human resources, and we have a miscellaneous category for those businesses, which are a little bit out of the box. Now, the roles are the people in the business. So let's click on operations and bear in mind that this will be different for your business. But say you had a business and under operations you had antenna installers. Now antenna installer is the role. That is the, the role within the business. And then the processes are all the tasks that that person or that role does on a daily, weekly or monthly basis. So you may have a video system on how to use a cherry picker. We'll just pause that for a moment and then say part two or the van presentation. Now, I know in, in your um, screenshot in your software, you're not going to be able to see these videos as well. Just because of the, the type of uh, software I'm using, these videos won't play as well as, you, as they're playing for me as I can see them. But you get the idea. Let's have a look at sales. Under sales, you may have the roles of a sales rep and telesales within your business. So you'd have all the processes which apply to that sales rep, such as handling objections, finding the needs of your customers, the company uniform. All these are actual videos. These are videos that you create, and through the iSystemize program, we show you exactly how to do that, how to role play. Now for documents, we can also store documents within the software because not everything can be created with video. So you may have documents for role playing, and this is something that they can print out directly from here. Let's have a look at administration. In administration, you may have a stock controller. Once again, stock controller is the role, and then all the processes that that stock controller does, like how to take a stock take, how to order new stock, manual stock checks. These are all videos which you create and enter into the software. Receptionist, how to answer the phone, how to redirect a call, greeting a visitor, handling the mail. See, all these are processes because what you need to understand is that the role is not about the person, it's about the role. So if this receptionist leaves, then that role can be filled very quickly and you can give them access to these processes so they can get up to speed before they start the job. I hope that makes sense because this is absolutely powerful. This is the way of you being able to automate your systems so you don't have to do all the training. Let's have a look at human resources. Under human resources, you may have a training manager and a HR manager. HR manager may look after some of the documents and videos for compliance reasons such as a sexual harassment policy. Now, you can't create a video system for sexual harassment. I mean, that's obvious, but you can create a document and you'd put a document in that area and have it there for compliance reasons. This can be printed out for staff to see and to read and to understand. And then you can give them a form, which we call an accountability form. And this accountability form, you can send to them and give it, and give it to your staff. They can sign off that they understand and then you can put it in their company employee file. That way it helps to increase the accountability of your staff within the business. So this is very, very simple to use. And as, as, as you get new systems, and we teach you exactly how to do this, you can add them to the, pro, add them to the software. Let's, let's do this, let's add a document. We click here by adding a document or a video, and then we look for a video within the, on your software, on your computer rather, and we bring in a, software, we can call it whatever you want, how to install an antenna, next, and then we assign it to the role, so operations, antenna installer, and click next, and here you can trim the video, so you can drag it down from, say, five seconds into the video, we can cut the end off it, and then you can click next, and then finish, and then that is added to the system. And then you can go and find that video, and they, a person can watch it and understand it, and they can sign off that they do understand it. Now the one great thing about iSystemize software is that you can tick these, the video processes which apply to that person, add them to a playlist, and then you can copy them to a USB, or copy them to an MP4 converter, 
and it's, it's entirely up to you. That way you can give it to the staff before they start with you and say, here, watch this. This is important that you watch this because this is your training and you need to do this before you actually start within our business. Let me show you what I mean. See in this here we have the computer. If you have all your systems on the computer, then it is only limited access to your staff. But if you copied them to MP4 player or to a USB stick, you can give them to your staff and say, this is what you need to watch to be up to, up to scratch on your training. That way the training is automated and systemized so you don't have to do it or someone within your organization has to do it. So I hope you see how powerful this is. This is just a very short demonstration of how the software works, but this is a way of being able to systemize and to make sure that your business works without you.